finally made it to the hotel. Uh, so actually it's not bad. So we even got Drew, room number one, and Bryce lost Rochambeau. Chateau de Bryce. So he's getting the fold out, full size sofa bed. Uh, but uh, tomorrow we're gonna be waking up and then at 10 a.m. gonna be going to Cars USA to pick up the TVR. It's about almost 11.30, so we're a little tired. Dr uh, Bryce drove all <laughs> all the way. So, how was that, Bryce? It's fine. Crushing miles, man. Like I'm crushing dreams. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right. So tomorrow I'm gonna wake up early and uh, do some fun video. So it is now Friday morning. We have just checked out of the hotel and headed towards truck and trailer, get loaded up. So first things first, gonna get some breakfast and then gonna go pick up the car at 10 a.m. So yeah, I need coffee. We're gonna keep it on the TV. I'm Bryce. Bryce, nice to meet you, Bryce. Nice to meet you. I'm Andrew. Andrew, pleasure. Nice to meet you. All right, come on in. Is this your first TVR? Yeah. Wow. Oh. <laughs> what a one to get. Oh, okay. What a cool shot. Mm -hmm. So you wanna get it covered? Yeah, I'm gonna try it. Okay, that's good. That's good. Need, get the bonnet open again, stop and begin. Oh. Um, yeah, it's like a knob, uh, I believe, on the left hand side. Mm -hmm. Morning, the doors won't open until A few minutes later. So that's where Bryce and I are going to be sitting back there. <laughs> um. <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> It's a good thing my legs are removable. First thoughts. All right. Uh, I mean, this is this is the first time seeing the car. I'm happy. This thing good. is so sexy. Yeah. It's it definitely it's very phallic. <laughs> but no, it's like okay. The doors are like are the size of Texas. Like I'm six feet tall, so my wingspan about six feet. It's a like a five yeah. foot long door. <laughs> it's an enormous door. Later. I'm like, let's see it. Uh oh. Uh oh. He's in there. The light was blinking for a second. Did the window roll? That's up? Yeah. <clears throat> the, the joys of a TVR ownership start. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna try to get this thing to actually open up. So I'm gonna turn the camera off just for a minute or just let it roll. Hold on, hold on, just real quick. English car doing English things. English car doing English things. <laughs> a little longer than a few minutes late. Record this from that angle over here. Yeah, they're off. That's off. Yeah, look at that mad dash. Why it's underneath the steering wheel like that. That's bizarre with the air. Friend coming right through the seat. Well, like, cool actually, your balls. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The cooler. Yeah, the got cooler. Yeah, the ball. ball you got to have balls to drive the on these cars. We got to have big balls, and they get hot and sweaty. Key. Man, I put it right down here. Oh gosh, it's like so awkward. That's the fuel pump. Sure. Neutral. Yeah. Woo. Right up. Ooh, that is rich. If you could 
just smell the amount of fuel coming out of this exhaust. Oh, we actually finally had, we figured out how to get the windows down and how to open the door and stuff. Yeah, but you need a system reset. Dude, you are riding dirty. <laughs> are you in the back seat or the front seat? I can't tell. Is this how Shaquille O'Neal feels? <laughs> I don't think he can get out. I think he's a permanent addition to the car now. Just bury me like this, Bryce. So now we got All right, I'm gonna full grip. light. <laughs> I get my car. All right, you've now driven your TVR. A whole 10 yards. Hey, it counts. Oh, I get my key out. Oh, don't tell me you did that. Here we go. <laughs> you've been locked out of this car how many times now? Twice. It's like laying down. Yeah. Oh, the door hits the seat. How does it feel uh, sitting in Aaron's coffin? He's gonna die in this. He's gonna be buried in it. Dude, it's like, hold on, you gotta see this. <laughs> Look at this windshield. I don't know if you understand. This no visibility. is it's less awesome. than like eight inches. This is like driving in a tank. Yeah, like here, my hand, for reference. Yeah, for real. That is so tiny. Look at this steering wheel and stuff though. It's pretty, it, oh, cool. it's really nice, nice in here. Uh, I'm like, get a breach. How you fitting in there, Bryce? Is there a pressure cuff? Yeah, that's where your lumbar support. So like, it's like a pressure cuff from like a, your doctor's oh office. God. You squish it and it um, oh gives you a little bit more of the lumbar support and we let it out just oh, this clip. Billet lock knobs. Gorgeous dash, dude. Oh, I know. Is it the, I forget, is it the middle? Yeah, it's, a, it's the burl. All right, Bryce. What are your impressions? It, here, it, wait, hold on, hold on. It's one thing to get into a car, uh, but when you pull up somewhere and a bunch of people are looking at you, yeah. let's see how you get out. It's... <laughs> <laughs> Very, Although, <laughs> very sophisticated. Yeah, it's it's all in it's all in the delivery. You got to leap with your head. <laughs> first impressions: the windshield is so narrow. <laughs> For real, yeah, that's the just... first thing I said too. <laughs> so like, because you, you have the this huge long hood. Yeah. Long. Okay. Size wise, it's honestly it feels like like an old school uh, Viper. It's a little narrower, but. I'm 6'3", and I fit very comfortably in there. Did you try in the driver's seat yet? All right. Yeah. All right. <laughs> okay. Paperwork fit in the car. Thank you. My roll bar, or my head's going to get crushed against a roll bar in this thing. All right, so the slider is on the front. Yeah, the tilt for the seat is on the normal right-hand side. Nope. <laughs> So it's like... Okay, then close the door, it's... Oh, God. It might not be built for people with broad shoulders. Yeah, like you're... My, <laughs> my headrest is the roll bar. Bryce, get in here with... <laughs> get, on, get from the other side so you can see where my head at. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> it, is, uh, it is incredibly like the fit and finish in here is way nicer than oh, I was yeah. expecting. Was Pop like, out. You know I mean, what? Like, I think my grandma's house had this carpet. <laughs> like, <laughs> it's so nostalgic. And I can press it so I can down. down. I'm like, bit me. Your car bit me. Like, so that guy was 6'4? The CEO was six foot four. Did he say he was six four? How long were his legs? Because yeah, I mean like yeah, maybe if like you're sitting more upright, drill, and maybe he was but just very. I can't see. I see the bottom of the tires. Look how full the cockpit space is. <laughs> I know. It's like there's nothing but Drew in there. Yeah. Well, let's be very clear. <laughs> I own an S2000 and I drove it for six years. <laughs> This is way tighter. <laughs> <laughs> I can't move my knee. I mean, if I'm in an accident, I'm I'm definitely in my own cockpit area. My shoulder is pressed against here, and my head. You can see where my head is. Where? It's uh, it's time to actually drive it and not kill myself. <laughs> so no, it's um, it sounds so good. It sounds so beastly. But, all right, um, so off to Hoonigan. All right guys, well the TVR is back home with me here in Arizona. It's because it's a Saturday, I can't hit the DMV until Monday morning. But once I get it registered, then it's gonna be dropping it off at the detail shop for a paint correction and ceramic coat. And then after that, gonna do a full video review of the car and what it's like to drive it and own it here in Arizona. So stay tuned. <laughs> 